hi guys so today I will show you how to line up your crochet bag it's not that difficult you just need to be keen and uh, come up with something like this yeah so let's go ahead and do that hello welcome back to my youtube channel hope you're all good today I want us to show you how to put a lining in your crochet and bag so what we need this is the lining you fold it into two this is the inside part this is the right side this is the wrong side you will need a marker a pair of scissors a thread and a needle so you will place your your bag like this on the liner on the lining then you're going to mark the way the shape of your bag is so we place it like that we are going to mark like this then since i placed it almost at the end of the line i'll not mark here i'll go ahead and mark on this side from here like this then on this other side we're gonna mark like this So we have the shape of the bag, we take the bag away, then now that's when we start using our scissors. You cut along this, the marking, you can use a chalk. But since mine is white, I decided to use a marker so that it is visible. We come to the other side. And we point over to the other side. So this is what we have, you can see it's the shape of our, of our bag, after you've cut, get your needle and thread, actually let's use the wet one because our bag, our lining is wet. Let's try to match 
you use the weight thread fold into two then put a knot at the end like that align your thread now we are going to do a back stitch around this lining remember this is the inside part eh? or the wrong side that's where we are going to stitch with a back stitch don't make it too tight or too long you can use any stitch that you're comfortable with but I find a back stitch more reliable so let's do, do the back stitch all around the lining then I'll find you when you are done it's not a lot of work but requires patience Let me see you when you're done with the back stitch around the lining all the way and also on the other side. But don't stitch on this side, just leave it open like that. So we are almost coming to the end of our back stitch for a lining I'm approaching the edge So at this point, make a knot and cut off your, your thread. So this is what we have. This is the wrong side, this is the inside part, so turn it like this
this is what we have come up with so get your bag let me remove the strap open up your zipper remember you put it the wrong side like this this will be the, on the right side of your bag put it in like this align it properly So this we will fold it as slightly on the inside like this and align with your zipper. Your zipper is black. I think the best thread that you are going to use will be black. So fold it a little bit on the inside like that. Then we will, you align your lining along the zipper like that then use your black thread to sew it now in your to your bag like that you can use pins or markers or whatever you have just to align your work to make it easy for you like that. Let me use. Uh, I use a small safety belt, safety pin. I mean, to align it so that it will be easier for you to sew it. So you can attach it like that, all uh, all round. So align your lining with some pins to be easier for you to to work with when you get to this corner you can see there is a shape here you put it inside out like this ensure now there is a line here that we joined that goes to the corner that should be in the middle attach it to the middle like that let's fold a bit then put our pin I'm just trying to align it to be easier for to sew it so we turn to the other side and do the same fold a bit a little bit not too much put a pin and also on this other edge we are folding just a little put a pin
so you remember there is another edge also this line should go to this corner here here so you attach it near the zipper or at the zipper line So after lining your liner, you can start off by sewing. We get a black thread. Our black thread and our needle fold into two then put a knot So I'll start from this, this corner. So you'll be just doing this I'll do, let's see. I'll try as much as possible to to grab this material on the on the zipper and attaching it with the lining like that. At the edge of your lining, like that that what we do around the bag not forgetting the corners where this seam is it should be very close to your zip that's where we are so that's what we do till we get to the other side it's not complicated at all
So that's the stitch that you use till you get to the end of your lining. So you, let me see you when you're done. It's not complicated at all. Once you've lined your your liner, it's just your thread and in draw throughout. You can take off this and that out so that you are able to do your sewing. So let's do that stitch till we get to the end. And we will be done with our lining. So we are almost coming to the end of our sewing, our lining. Hope you had a good time doing this. So I can take off this so that it will be easier to sew. It has been an, an adventure for me. <laughs> it takes time, but it is worth it. The things that you can do with your hands, you feel more fulfilled when you have done something for yourself. So I'm done. Almost done lining my cross bag that I'm done recently. Let's see how it looks like after the lining. We are almost there. A few stitches to go. How is your going? Let me know. Did you like it? Was it easy? Was it difficult? Comment below. Let me know if you are able to fall to do it. Or what else do you want to learn from me? I'm always ready to show you and to train you. So we are back to the where we started. So I just put a knot here and cut off my thread now that I'm, I'm done sewing. Then I'll cut off this thread like that. And just like that, we are done.
that's the inside that's the bottom these are the signs and uh, I'm glad it has come out very well we can sip our bag and take back our strap we are so done so done finished so guys if you liked this tutorial please give this video a like comment don't forget to subscribe also that's how you support my channel share with your friends yeah put on the notification bell so that you are not left out with out of the any upload that i make so that is it see you in the next video bye